Spring quarter is here and while you can expect tight parking conditions once again, some good news is just around the corner. Construction is finally about to wrap up on this brand new lot just for students. As you can see, it's right next to the parking garage, so it's really easy to find. Construction on the new 32S lot started back in the fall but came to a complete stop when the cold weather hit. Once it opens sometime this quarter, it will have more than 300 new parking spaces. Here's the tricky part. It's connected to the new lots, 30 and 31S, that opened last year. As it stands right now, you enter and exit off Spring Street. But once the entire project is finished, that all changes. You'll only be able to enter the lots from Jefferson Avenue. Spring Street will only be an exit spot, so be ready for that change. Until the new lot opens, you can expect some tight parking conditions during peak hours. Take a look at the areas shaded in orange on this map. Those are the many different student parking areas. As you can see, they're spread out all around campus. If you arrive between 10 and 2, skip the lots closest to the campus since they'll fill up early. Instead, look further out. One option is the overflow parking at Fort Hayes High School just across I-670. It's open Monday through Thursday and it's just about a 5 minute walk to campus. There's also the 28S lot. It's further out, maybe an 8 minute walk, but it's one of the last areas to fill up each day. You'll find it on Mount Vernon Avenue, a full two blocks down from the bookstore on Mount Vernon Avenue. And don't forget, there are real-time parking updates on Twitter from 9 till noon during the first week of the quarter. You'll find it at CSCC underscore parking. With the new lots, there are now well over 5,000 parking spaces on campus, including 1,000 in the parking garage. 